Little dragon coconuts, small wings, big dragon heart. With your friends flying high, making flips up in the sky. You are having lots of fun on your island in the sun. Matilda, Oscar, Coconut, you are superstars. One for all, all for one. You're brave, whatever comes. Standing strong together, always smart, always clever. Coconut and his gang face anything hand in hand. Coconut and his gang. Oscar's here, could Matilda stay over too? Oh, I don't see why not. Yay! Sleepover! We're going to have a sleepover! <laughs> here comes Coconut's dad! Yay! <laughs> huh? Oscar? Maybe you should slow down a bit. You might get indigestion. Not me. <laughs> My stomach lining's like iron. Um, how long did you say Oscar was staying? I'm not sure. I said we'd look after him while Adele and Herb went on a truffle hunt. Uh, and, um... How long does it take to hunt a truffle? <laughs> What's for supper? You just had it! I thought that was lunch. Yep, it was lunch too. <laughs> yeah, but I did a week's shopping yesterday. That's before our <coughs> guest arrived. Oh. Well, let's hope his mum and dad find their truffles quickly. Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Ta da! Beat that, Oscar! Oh. Oscar? Oscar, don't you think we ought to wait until we get it onto the table? Snored myself awake again. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Someone was hungry. <laughs> should know, Oscar. You had it last night. What? Huh? What do you mean? Someone had a bit of a midnight feast, didn't they? Oh, <gasps> the food cupboard's empty! It wasn't me. See? I'm starving. You're always starving, Oscar. Oh, well, no use crying over spilt milk or empty food cupboards. Off you go, Magnus. What? Where to? To get some more groceries, of course. We've got to eat. <gasps> Need some help, Dad? <laughs> oh. We'll come too. Hmm. It 
wasn't me. I can prove it. How? All right. I can't prove it. Right, you three, off to bed. And no sneaking downstairs for a snack in the middle of the night. But I... Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, must have snored myself awake again. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Someone was hungry. <laughs> Thank you, Pop Magnus. See you later. It wasn't Oscar, Mum. I'm sure of it. Oscar isn't greedy. Well, not that greedy. Oh, thanks for sticking up for me. That's what friends are for. But Oscar... It wasn't me. But who else could it have been? Suppose it wasn't Oscar. I keep telling you. Suppose it was a burglar. A b burglar? Yes, a burglar. Someone who creeps into the house at dead of night, snaffles our food and sneaks out again. So maybe we could build a trap to catch him in. <laughs> yes, great idea, Matilda. Uh, how do we build this trap? Hmm. We'll need a big net and we could use the rope from the swing and... Oh, no bait. We'll have to wait until Dad gets home before we can bait the trap with food. One food thief trap, all ready to catch a food thief. How does it work? Huh? <laughs> oh! oh, ow! <laughs> um, a bit like that? <gasps> <sighs> Pastry? Yes, please. <clears throat> <sighs> Did you enjoy that, Oscar? <clears throat> yes, thanks. <laughs> Couldn't eat another thing. Come on, time for bed. Right. You keep an eye on the trap from my bedroom window. And I'll keep watch outside. As soon as they've all gone to bed, I'll come back down here. Huh? If it's not a burglar, then I'll find out who is the food thief. Thief? <gasps> 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 
Truffle hunting go. Find any? I'm sorry. I really am. Imagine sleepwalking. <laughs> Sleep eating? Yes. I was wondering how I got into the kitchen. But it wasn't really Oscar's fault. He didn't know what he was doing. Well, that's gourmet dragons for you. Even when they're asleep, they think of nothing but their stomach. Oh, of course. I was forgetting that you fire dragons are so much better than everyone else. Now, Adele, Oscar did eat them out of house and home. Oh, uh, not quite. There's still plenty of food left in the cupboard. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, 